Hi there, I'm Ben. I'm Josh from Brown Dog Gadgets. Uh, Josh, uh, we're out in the middle of nowhere and I see you have a gun with you. What are we doing here today? Well, we're going to find out how durable um, the new Badger solar panel is. Now, this thing is waterproof, but we've taken a lot of pr time and effort and pride in uh, making sure our panels are as durable as possible. So we're going to find out exactly how durable the physical panels are on these things. Uh, with so the these are the actual cells we're talking about, which we've, uh, we've got one of those right here. Exactly. We've got our uh, Badger panel. Um, it's got a nice plastic cover on it, a very thick piece of plastic that's scratch resistant and pretty impact resistant. And we've got our standard off the shelf kind of panel. You might find one of these on an eBay solar panel or a Amazon panel. Very standard epoxy covered solar product. So we're going to compare the two of these with a 22. Now hang on, you're not suggesting that these are actually bulletproof solar panels, are you? I oh. mean, I, I got a coffee table, I tried that. <laughs> no, 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 I actually fully expect to shoot through these. We're going to actually see how much damage um, is done to each of these to compare. We'll actually see which takes the less amount of damage between the two panels. Okay, so let's set up some slow-mo cameras and go uh, solar panel target shooting. <laughs> So we got the competition on the left and the uh, Badger panel on the right uh, firing a 22 into a solar panel. Well, that's five of the Badger. Let's try five in the other. So five in each, let's see what happens. Well. <laughs> what do you think? About the same, actually. <laughs> let's yeah, see so how well, well they through. went through on this one. Oh yeah, they blew out the backside pretty darn well. Oh wow, that's weird. It's uh, like fiberglass backing. Well, yeah, like any circuit board's bits. fiberglass. Sure. Let's try these guys. <laughs> pretty much the same. Oh. And my one first shot, which was low. Uh, pretty much uh, they both handle about the same. So what we're gonna say is that solar panels are not bulletproof. No, not these guys. Uh, the 20 gauge, it fared better on the 20 gauge than did the 22. Uh, but you know, actually I have a few more shots left uh, on the other 22. I could uh, take a few more shots to see what the heck happens. <laughs> Oh, in case anyone was wondering, oh, I'll go with the camera. In case anyone was wondering, that was uh, the other gun with my 1022 takedown from Ruger. And this is my uh, Ruger uh, 9622, the little known, little loved uh, lever action version of the 1022, which I like way too much. So we're gonna give a little lever action fun with this guy. Oof. Yeah, you put a bunch of holes in solar panels. <laughs> Definitely not bulletproof. Nope, not at all. Uh, and clearly I'm a much better shot with the uh, 22 than I am the 20 gauge. When I doubt, get a brown dog to come join you. And thanks for our wonderful assistant, Mac, the dog, who is uh, a nice Britney Spaniel for helping out. So, so Josh, if somebody wanted to learn more about solar panels, where would they go? They would go to browndoggadgets.com for our wonderful solar panels or our Kickstarter we're starting and doing this video for, um, for our Badger solar panel. We have those as well as our older Kickstarter solar panel and a bunch of solar panels for educational projects or do-it-yourself projects. So we've got everything you need and more.